Good morning everyone. In this video we'll be checking common method bias also known as CMB and CMV common method variant uh, using full collinearity assessment in smart PLS. Okay so let me give you an overview of my variable here. I've taken techno stress overload as an independent variable, techno stress uh, sorry, techno overload as my independent variable, techno ambiguity my independent variable, techno stress as a mediator, and then customer satisfaction as a dependent variable. Since we'll be checking, we'll be checking C and B in our data using full collinearity assessment. So let me first run a simple collinearity assessment using PLS algorithm in Smart PLS. There you go. Okay, let's go straight to VIF values and then inner values. Here I see none of the value of related to any variable is as high as 3.3, which is a threshold to establish to threshold to establish high collinearity. However, this absence of high collinearity in this way, uh, in this model, we cannot we cannot establish yet that you know our our, our data is free of. CMB common method bias. So this is what I've done for the. This is what I've done to test it. Uh, same model I have drawn here. Okay, and I've removed all the paths. And here I'm taking age. Okay, age. And let's draw the path between all these variables to age. So in this case, this way, all of my variables now are independent variable and the age is dependent variable. What, what we need to make sure here is we can take any variable as long as unrelated to our original research, our original conceptual model. So here, age has been added as a variable which has no impact on my results, which has, which has no focus, you know, it, it doesn't have, it has nothing to do with the hypothesis I've drawn for this study. So age is an unrelated variable in this my study as a result i'll be i should be able to check whether my data has issue of cmb or not let's go back using age as a dependent variable all of my other variable as an independent variable let's go back and run pls algorithm let's go to vif value inner vif value there you go uh, custom satisfaction and all other variable and it's latent variable which is age itself um, the collinearity assessment shows that none of our variable has any high correlation with collinearity with our latent variable which is age and hence we are able to establish based on that you know our data is free of CMB okay that's about it